people. Good morning, my people. Um, I'm mid-workout right now, so I'm like out of breath. Whew. Uh, our apartment got a new gym, so we have two gyms now. And so we're like, oh, we'll just go check it out. We heard it was supposed to be like a yoga studio or something. It is definitely not a yoga studio. It has everything. It has machines like my old apartment gym had. And if you guys have been following me for a while, you know I was kind of bummed when my gym didn't have a stair stepper, you know? My new apartment gym didn't have one. And now look. I'm so excited. <laughs> um, but yeah, there's a bunch of stuff. Um, I'll give you guys a full tour and I can catch my breath a little. I'm gonna finish up my workout and then I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Oh, I need to wear sunglasses. <laughs> I was recording. Shut up. <laughs> Welcome to the Brianna K Fitness Show. What is going on, guys? I'm in back. <laughs> I'm sounding like a genius. Three, two, one. What is going on, guys? I am back at it again with another commentary. I want to walk you guys through this workout. This workout is going to be legs with a little bit of hit, but the reason why I wanted to film this workout is because it is a leg workout with no squats. And a lot of people ask me if you absolutely have to do squats when you're training legs, and you do not have to. Um, there are a lot of exercises that you can do that will help grow your glutes and grow your legs that are not squats. So if you have injured knees or some type of injury that prevents you from doing squats, you can give some of these ones a try. Um, the first one that I was showing you are Bulgarian split squats. So for this workout, you wanna make sure that you do not have an overextended knee. You wanna make sure that your knee is not going over your toe. Um, someone actually pointed that out to me a few months ago and I didn't realize I was doing an overextended knee. And ever since I made sure not to make my knee go over my toe, I have seen such good results and I actually started seeing progress. I actually started getting sore. Um, so definitely make sure that you are doing the correct form. If you cannot add the dumbbells in the very beginning, that's okay. Just do it without dumbbells. Then I moved on to cable kickbacks. They don't have the right cable, uh, like foot attachment, if that makes sense. I might purchase my own so I can actually do this a little bit better. Because looking back at the footage, my form doesn't look the best because you can see my foot's kind of sliding. But that's all they had in my apartment gym and I was just getting creative. <laughs> um, then I threw in some box jumps because box jumps suck. <laughs> just kidding, but they get you out of breath. They're like a nice little hit burst when I'm working out I do like to keep it very uh, high intensity and a lot of reps and like short breaks because My main goal is like fat loss and weight loss. So I want to make sure that I'm keeping my intensity up Then I moved into this little combo. This is gonna be two workouts in one and I'm using the kettlebell. So what you're gonna do is it is a uh, straight leg deadlift. So you're gonna go into a straight leg deadlift and then you're gonna go into a squat like immediately after. And this is kind of good. It's a, a good superset. It is pretty easy. I mean, you don't have to use a kettlebell if your gym doesn't have one. You can use a dumbbell. You don't have to use any weight if you're a beginner. Um, but definitely this one to try it is really good because it does get your heart rate up because you are super setting two exercises one after the other um then my gym finally has a line leg curl and i'm so excited so um my old gym, apartment gym in marietta had this and i loved it so now i'm really excited um so obviously you guys have seen me do lying leg curls a bunch and I think I've mentioned this a bunch too but make sure to keep that tension when you are blah, 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 blah. make sure to keep that tension when you are doing lying leg curls you want to make sure they don't fully extend down or it's going to take that tension off your hamstrings and you're going to stop getting those gains and you're going to stop growing your hammies and all that stuff so um then I moved into jump squats and again another hip burst I really wanted this workout to be high intensity because I was eating like poop over Christmas and New Year's and all the holidays I really wanted to just burn all that off um, so that's kind of why I threw in some jump squats with that <laughs> what you doing what you doing sleeping <laughs> get it yeah <laughs> I decided to do some squats on the BOSU ball with the kettlebell. Um, this one is going to be a little bit more advanced because it is kind of hard to balance on that ball. Uh, but once you get the hang of it, it'll be okay. I remember the very first time, like one of my first times in the gym, uh, 
we, me and my friend had a trainer and I, he told me to get on the BOSU ball and I could not even stand on it. So if you can't balance on it just yet, it's okay. It does come with time and now it's like super easy to stand on, but it never was for me in the beginning. Like I could not do it. I fell like right on my face when I tried. Um, but that was the end of my workout and at the end I added 20 minutes of stair stepper. Um, you guys asked me if I do any cardio. I always do cardio after every single workout for about like 20 to 30 minutes. So I hope you guys liked it. If you did like this workout section of the video, give the video a big old thumbs up. Hey guys, so I just got done with stair stepper so I'm really sweaty and really gross. Um, but, so our apartment uh, complex opened up like another side. So like a whole nother uh, set of apartments. There's like a brand new pool over here. And they also put a brand new gym and the gym has a lap pull down, leg extension, lying leg curls. They've got bikes, they've got the stair stepper like I was showing you guys. Uh, they have like a separate room with like, uh, like kettlebells and like medicine balls if you wanna do like full body circuits. <laughs> so <laughs> it's a lot bigger than the other ones. We've got two gyms in this apartment complex, so they must know that I like fitness. <laughs> so um, yeah, anyway, I had a really good workout. Uh, I haven't vlogged at all today, kind of starting the vlog a little bit late, but that's okay. <laughs> um, so right now, I'm walking back to my apartment. I actually don't think I'm gonna be able to get in because Cody left early because he didn't do cardio, so I'm gonna have to call him so I can get back in my apartment. Um, but all in all, it's been a good day. I mean, edited my video, YouTube video, put that out. Now, <sighs> worked out, cleaned my house, and now I'm ready to just like go home and relax. <laughs> I'm so tired. Okay, I'm gonna call Cody now so I can get back into my house. I came home from the gym, and this one looks so cute that I had to sit her next to me. <laughs> We're spending some quality time, huh, Lulu? No? I'm just being camera shy. Come here. She's my cuddler. <laughs> you are my sunshine. So, I've got a funny story for you guys. My life right now is a joke, an absolute joke. <laughs> so, what happened was I had a vet appointment today. So, um, Cookie had the cyst that I was telling you guys about. The vet wants me to kind of, I don't, I'm trying to clean at the same time. I don't know what I'm doing. The vet wants me to uh, take her in to get checked up to make sure the cyst is okay. And then Lulu, my other guinea pig, her heart's been beating kind of funny. So they are like worried it could be like a heart murmur or heart disease or something terrible. So to be honest, I've been feeling like I'm having a panic attack like all night and all day yesterday. Um, I just love my guinea pigs so much like my pets are my babies and it's been really hard the last month because I had to feed Cookie through a syringe for two weeks straight that was absolute hell and then I had to dig in her cut with peroxide and it's just been so stressful and now Lulu I'm really worried about so it's just been a lot right now that's not where it ends so then I go uh, to go down to my car because I need to take them to the vet and I'm walking down to my car and I haven't seen my car since like before Christmas because I have to park it like outside of the apartment complex. So I go to walk down to my car and I see my car and my windows busted in and my car got broken into and uh, I don't even know what to say. I was just like, are you kidding me? So I couldn't take them to the vet today and I, there's glass all over both of my seats, the front seat and the passenger seat. And so I'm sitting there like digging glass out with my hands, just like, thinking like, what is my life like? This sucks, so um, that's what's happened today. So I'm just feeling like, ugh. Uh, but anyway, I don't wanna make this video like all sad. I'm just going through some stuff right now, but I'm taking them to the vet tomorrow, so I will let you guys know what's going on with that. My phone keeps going off. I probably should put on silent. But anyway, my brother is gonna come over and stay the night with us tonight. Um, he's been really wanting to come stay the night with me and Cody. Uh, so we're gonna have a good weekend with him. So, picking up my house right now, I'm like vacuuming and like wiping down my counters and I'm sure we'll go to the gym, but that's kind of my life update right now. It's kind of what's been going on. So, I'm gonna rise above this. I'm not gonna let it affect me anymore. Um, I honestly, I don't even really care that much about my car. I'm just really worried about my guinea pigs, so I will let you guys know what's going on with them. And yeah. All right guys, that's gonna be for this video. Hope you guys liked it. If you did like this video, please give it a big old thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I will catch you in the next one. Hit subscribe. Yeah, my brother said. Love you guys.
Thanks for watching. Bye.